All right, we are here hunting tobacco hornworms. I found one as I was analyzing my pepper here. I thought, what the fudge? How did an entire branch disappear? And here's the culprit right there. So I am going to knock him into my little bucket here. Go go. Get off my plant, bugger. I need to a death grip on this thing. Alright, let's see if I can pick him off with my pruners here. No, he's not gonna go willingly. Fine. And you know, let's see if I can cut off his horn here. Or unless. Oh, look at that. He's dripping something. I probably don't want to get that on my skin. Maybe I can just leak him to death. Alright, he is still leaking. A little bit here and there. Maybe he's getting dehydrated. Not sure what's going on. Alright, time for you to come off. Get, get, get off. Alright, I'm gonna go search for the rest of them. Where there's one, there's definitely many. Hopefully we'll find one that has the parasitic wasp larva sticking out of it. That'll look awesome. All right, and now the proper disposal of these pieces of crap. Put them on our altar here. And then we bring out the proper disposal method. Here we go. Alrighty, here we go. That's why they call it tobacco hornworm. They bleed tobacco juice after being offered. And there we have the proper way of disposal.